Okay. Start this again. Hello. But tenders uh, don't care if you're healthy or not. Not really. Society, the world is geared towards us being unhealthy. Prepackaged food. I tried to diet. I thought going and getting the prepackaged meals out of the freezer and portion my food would be get me to lose weight and it really did and I couldn't understand why I wasn't losing weight there was so much sodium in it that my blood pressure was going up there's other preservatives in it to make it taste good to last longer it really wasn't good for me they don't really want us healthy they really don't because it is a multi-million dollar business Going to McDonald's and getting a hamburger and fries, you've already got, what, six, eight hundred calories just in that, not counting the soft grain. So you got a big glass, you got a grain, and 20 ounces is probably around 300 calories. So you get two or three refills. So you've done already acquired this large amount. Society, not just food, has made it easy for us to become couch potatoes, to become computer geeks, to become gamers. Uh, endless list. But the pretenders, I come across them all the time. And I get really, really upset when they pretend they care. They may go to the gym with you and say, yeah, I want to get in better shape. And blah, blah. But they're just doing it. They really don't care. You went from going out to eat all the time to maybe want to eat at home or eat portion meals. And they'll say, well, just come on, just just watch what you eat. We'll go out or whatever. They don't really care. They really don't. You could get deathly sick or whatever. And... You'll find out who's really there and who's really not in the situation. Now, a lot of them's in errors. I've seen this on a lot of cases. People who uh, are bedridden want certain food. Instead of keeping them, instead of helping them with their weight loss, they're getting them those McDonald's burgers or Hardy burgers or whatever, or all this junk food. You see the signs. You, you know, I love, I like donuts. But I don't need them. I really don't. Sit down and eat cookies. The problem is, is stress eating. I stress eat. I eat when I'm in pain. I eat when I'm depressed. I just, you know, you go to a dinner. You overeat. You wind up, uh, they, you could be trying to change your lifestyle for a healthier benefit. But these companies, these places, it is their business to sell you these products. So if everybody tomorrow decided they want to quit eating donuts to become healthier, the donut places would go under. <clears throat> if everybody tomorrow quit buying frozen TV dinners, the businesses would go under that's just how it is you have sites upon sites who are wanting you to get to portion meals buy these meals but they're loaded with preservatives and then you will lose the weight but they're encouraging you to get to diet pills they're encouraging you to get this and encourage so it's all about not being healthy when it comes down to it you have to do it yourself to be healthy you have to have a support of someone who is going to stand by you and help you become healthy. Unfortunately, there are so many people out there who's going to tell you different or going to pretend they really care. They're going to pretend they're going to help you. But you still have to decide yourself so they really don't want you healthy 
the companies really don't want they you know put the calories up there and they change out a lot of the stuff to make people who's make them contented let's put it that way but you're still the one that's got to put everything in your mouth because it tastes good i love hamburgers but i can't have them i can't have beef i can have small amounts but i've learned how to slow down my eating i've had to start cutting my food up and eat a little at a time i exercise but you can still just on the health part too trying to be healthy you can go out and buy all these products and all these vitamins and all this stuff to become healthy and that still can follow the same thing but tenders and enablers are the worst of the worst in my opinion if they know you're trying to be healthy having junk food around you or whatever they uh, incur want you to go out to eat and you've cut back eating out or whatever and once you go out to eat and then you're eating things you really don't need to eat they uh but 10 at the gym you know the 10 are supporting you they're saying just this time it ain't gonna matter go ahead just just have that little slice of uh, pie you want another slice? Here, just take this other slice. I mean, I won't eat all this. Take this other slice home with you. So that's how being unhealthy in the world is how is big business. It's big business because insurance companies or hospitals or whatever makes money off you being sick. Medications make money off you being sick. People who prefer you to be unhealthy feels they can have a control within your life. I mean, you begin to think less of yourself. You don't feel like you're worth it. And often that suits their needs. Because as long as you feel like you're worth something other, uh, you feel healthy or better about yourself. They feel that you would no longer need them. So... Being unhealthy is a big money business. Pretenders who pretend they care, it's really important to them that you're not healthy because if you're healthy, then you are not going to be dependent on them. So it's just a cold hard fact. Companies, businesses, people, they want you unhealthy. If you're healthy, you're not going to need these type of processed foods. You're not going to need to go and eat a half a dozen donuts in one sitting. You're not going to need to eat that half pack of cookies. You're not going to need to eat all those chips. So it's going to affect their money. And but tenders wants to go out and do that eating they want to sit there and just watch the tv they don't want to be really active they don't want to go to the gym with you really they really don't want to help you be healthy because if you're healthy then you're not you're going to be doing things that they don't want to do so it's a lot to think about I believe in all honesty, businesses, companies, as well as people, pretenders, enablers, really don't want you healthy. I mean, it's just how it is. I'm going to be healthy. I'm going to take this weight off. I'm going to better myself. And I'm not going to let no pretender stop me from achieving what I'm going to achieve. I've had that happen too many times in my life. And made feel less than a person. I have goals. I have achievements. And I'm going to do it. I want to take care of myself. When the injuries happened. My weight came on. My depression got worse. And the pretenders and the enablers. Made me feel. 
less of a person. So this is live prayer here. I want you to be safe, be happy. Bless you all.